Yeah, let's get that. And then a... I need a bale fork. Buy that. Let's get that stuff home by the magic method. It's the best method of all. Woo, we made it. <laughs> All-wheel drive on. Okay. Got that. Turn on our beacons. Um, you know what? We're going to do this just because I'm concerned about bail weight. If it causes problems, we'll sort it out later. There we go. <laughs> Gets me a little bit more traction on those rear wheels, too. Okay, let's go see if we can get a bail and bring it back. Without the usual disaster that ensues. You know, I'm going to put it on three. No, I'm not. Two, two, two. Oh, crap. Slow it down. Slow it down. Oh, thank goodness this thing has better brakes than the booher. Ugh. Whoa. All right. Whew. Made it. All right. Let's go get a bale. Oh, good night. Just coming onto the field, and look at that. It slows right down. All right, here we go. We're going to approach our first bale. Okay. Bail in. Bail up. <laughs> Bail back. Of course, this is not at the in-game bail, so... Um, yeah. I probably need to t check the more realistic uh, bailer over the John Deere. Because I think John Deere is going to have still the old bail style. It was me being lazy trying to get it. Yeah, whoa. Get on there. Thank you. All right, let's... Um, before we even forget, let's do that. Uh, bye bye. Doot, 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 doot. Uh, is that the round bale? Yeah, that's a square bale. Square bale, round bale. What do we want? We want. You know what? I, I'm. Hmm. Power requirement 150. Okay. Let's get that one then. All right, I'll have the Lindener deal with that later. Um, yeah. Climb the hill. All-wheel drive. Massively important in this map. <laughs> uh, I probably should just use a loading wagon, shouldn't I? Yeah. Let's do that. As soon as I crest the hill, because I'm not about to... I'm afraid I'm going to roll back down the hill. <laughs> oh, my goodness. All-wheel drive really does matter, by the way. Really does matter. Okay. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Come on, Bubba. Make it up the hill. Excellent. Excellent. Good tractor. Good tractor. All right. I don't know where I'm going to put this exactly, but um, let's, uh, let's find a spot for this. Where are we going to put this? Um, I don't know. Let's, let's just put it over here for now. I was going to put it right there. That's a road. Put it there, Darren. You're going to be in trouble. 
Go. Come on, flip. Oh, for fudge sakes. There we go. Good. Stay like that. <laughs> uh, I think I'm going to have to get a, um, a shovel to get all this. So there's barley and there's maize, and I do have some. So I'm probably going to have to get a shovel to load all that stuff up. So we will do that. Um, I have no idea what that... Oh, is that with the cow poop? Is that where we shovel the cow poop out? <laughs> that would be my luck, wouldn't it? All right. Um, not you. Not you. All right, let's... Hit two. I just want to kind of cut a... Uh, cut a headland in here. Three, maybe? No. There we go. Somehow I needed that little push. Little push. I'm thinking I'm forgetting. Oh, I was going to buy a forage wagon. Okay, hold on. All right. Got ourselves a nice little headland here. See if we can back up this hill. Ugh! Sorta. Come on, a little bit farther. Yeah! Excellent. Cut ourselves a little headland, because otherwise it's insane. Look at how this field flows. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I think I can cut this into a bunch of squares. Sort of like this, I mean, the corn is almost perfect in terms of square. Um, so I think I'm going to I'm going to try to mirror that create sort of square ish fields um, just to try to, to allow the hired worker to do something really. OK, um, okay. there. <laughs> oh my goodness. Turn that off. We were going to buy a loading wagon. Okay. This is an $81,000 loading wagon. 160 horses. Oh boy. All right. So let's buy it. Let's go and look at our oop, tractors. So we have this guy that's 102. We have the Booher that's 135. The other one's 102. So we are going to have to buy something with some chutzpah. Uh, this is 320. It's 270. It's 117. That's not enough. This is 100. That's nowhere near enough. That's no. Uh, <laughs> that's unknown. Oh, wait. No. I don't know. Um... Two oh nine. Two. You know what? This one just seems like the better deal right now. So let's buy that. Excellent. Reset those two because I am not about to do that drive. Oop. All right. Cool. This boy. You know I'm not gonna have a problem with this. Well, other than the fact I'm probably gonna drive it like crap, but. Uh, oh, okay. Uh, like that. Hook up. Good. And then I'm going to add... Oh, wrong track. Okay, this. Boom. Yeah, there we go. There's some serious wheels. Yeah, we're big wheels. We're big wheel and... Um, i got to figure out how to turn the sucker around. Okay. Oh, look at the slip percentage. This one has the slip percentage. So when I accelerate fast, I'm going to slip more. So it does make you pay attention to that slip percentage. Ah! And also I'm going to crash into stuff because I'm not paying attention and I'm looking at the slip percentage. 
There's almost 10% slip there. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, this tractor is a little bit big for this farm. I will say that much. Some of you are like, duh, but the thing is the power it has is important for this farm. This might let me get rid of the, uh, the Lindener. Oh, what am I stuck on? What? Oh. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Straighten this out. Oh. Okay, made the turn. Jeez. Let's get in the cab really quick. Time for the long, dangerous downhill here. Uh, two. Nope, nope, that's too fast. One. Okay, brakes, brakes, uh, brakes. Come on. Uh, I think we made it. Oh, hold on, hold on. Oh, bucket of nails. That's dangerous. Oh, we made it. Oh, that was fun. Right? <laughs> Turn on the forage wagon. Let's go. Uh, so let's let's get this straw collected. So you got five percent, six percent, seven percent. You'll notice the slip increases as I attempt to climb a hill. Um, either this thing doesn't have native four wheel drive, or it ha or it doesn't have four wheel drive, or it has native four wheel drive, meaning I don't actually need to engage it. But look at that. One big monster climbing this hill. You can see we're sort of side slipping. I'm sort of having to steer up the hill because the tractor will actually slip sideways. Amazing. Big old engine growling. Yeah. Turn that off. Look at that. <laughs> oh my goodness, 11% slip. Yeah. Insanity. Dun, 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 dun. This was a good purchase, I think. <laughs> I think this one will be able to handle uh, plowing up those hills. Oh, man. All right. Let's get it turned around here. Yeah, we're completely lifting the uh, the left side of the tractor off the deck. Nice. The only addition that I could see that would make this map like phenomenally perfect is if, and it and they can't do it. It's not the fault of the map author. It's not the fault of anybody other than Giant. Would be showing like the the track marks, like digging into the dirt when I'm making those turns, and that with all the weight of this tractor. Can't do anything about that. All right, let's turn around. I have to do something about that bale and then the other bale that ran away. I'm gonna have to go find that one again. Get in the cab a minute. Okay. All right, that's my target. Actually, you know what? Let's just take the big line of stuff there. We're going to have to climb up this hill, so we're going to find out the power of the Xeron 3800. Oh my goodness. Come on. Come on, baby. You can do it. Yeah. Yeah. Woohoo! She did it. Yeah, now that we're going downhill, we're getting like 0% slip. Perfect. A little bit of slip there. That's all right. Yeah, so the Xeron can get up onto this hill where uh, the harvester just can't. So we're going to turn that, all that, and probably this line here, we're going to turn it over into grass. Uh, I don't think it's going to hurt us, hurt us too badly. 
basically my goal here in this month is to make it so that our friend he uh he comes back and his farm is set like he'll come back from his trip to america and just be like oh wow you are awesome either that or i'll set his entire farm on fire which i've done before so you know whatever Woo. all right i need that lindener to move oh come on baby come on baby come on you can make that climb oh wow what are we doing here Seriously, we got 37% slip on this hill. Ah, that's interesting. Wow. Come on, baby, don't do this to me. There we go. We made it. We made it over the hill. All right, I think we got almost all of the, uh, the straw, other than what that Lindener is sitting on. Oh, there's some over here. While I'm thinking about it, though, let's stop this guy for a minute. Now, I'm going to go in here. Let's see here. The Lindener Geotrack. 102 horsepower. Hmm. Yeah, I think I'm going to sell the Lindener. Boosh. She was a nice little friend, but um, on this map, hmm, no. Look at that, 50% slip right off the bat. Don't gun it. <laughs> uh, she was a nice friend, but I think I'm going to need more equipment like this, that Fent 936. I mean, we need large-scale equipment. <laughs> or at least strong equipment. Something like that. Oop, a little bit of side slip there. Okay. Do I care about that straw there? Hmm. Not enough to try to figure out how to make that turn. <laughs> how that works out. Uh... Okay. So we'll have plenty of straw for the cows. We're going to buy some cow. Um, and you get hay for the cows, hmm, and chaff. Chaff I can do, I'll, oh, I know what I'll do. Instead of plowing that over, I think I'm going to get the, uh, the kid. I've got the kid forage harvester. I think I'll run the kid forage harvester up there with the, the old tow behind trailer. That's probably a good use of that, that stuff I cannot get to. That'll get us chaff we need. I did just hit the brakes, by the way. Turn that off. So this is going to get more difficult to climb this hill now. Because I got 53% straw in this. Go. Let's rock and roll. Thankfully, I've got a big, powerful engine in here. <laughs> uh, righty. Huh. Um. Remember what I said about big, powerful engine? Uh-huh. Um. <laughs> trying to get over on the dirt to try to get, get some more traction on dirt. There we go. There we go. We got some traction going. We got some traction. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. You can do this. No, you can't, can you? Okay. We, we've got two sets of tires off of the de off the, the asphalt. But we're slipping everything. Hmm. Um. Turn this on really quick. Let's 
jump to the tractor. Let's see. Can I add some ballast on here? Ooh. Can I add the ballast and get some more traction? Uh, doesn't appear to have worked that way. Uh huh. Hmm. I'm going to have to think about this. <laughs> I've got a bunch of straw, but I don't apparently have a tractor that can make the climb. That's amazing. What if I take off those extra wheels? Does that actually help the tractor? Not particularly. Skinny wheels help? No. Well, we're sort of... Oh my gosh, but this part of the hill is even steeper than the part I'm cl trying to climb now. Um, good grief. Come on, baby. You can do this. Okay, going straight gets me a little bit more traction, but not nearly enough. Oh, 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 here we go. Uh, 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 okay. No. <laughs> hmm. Oh, there we go, there we go, there we go, 30%, 20, 20, oh, uh, we got slip sorted. Oh, but then we started slipping again. 90% slip. I'm basically screwed. Like, there's no good way to get this tractor up in the... Gosh. All right, let's get rid of the ballast. Does that help me at all? No. No, it doesn't. And there goes my tractor. I hate you, tractor. <sighs> okay, how are we going to do this now? Um, let's, let's look. 